honey. You look sad. What's the matter? I would like to update you on the recruitment of growth and innovation manager who comes very highly recommended by the hand hunting company, uh, Benson. Benson has behinded growth and scale in the companies he has worked for and I believe we have found the right competencies for TMX. Have a look at his papers. That's, good, that's a good update. This looks exceptional. I think you can proceed. I trust your judgment. Thank you. Can you close? Hello. Hi, honey. Hi, how are you? Fine, thanks. Are you well? I'm okay. How was your day? Oh, my day was, uh, was beautiful. Very huh? interesting, actually. Oh. So, remember the company I was telling you about, TMX? Yes. Yes, so today they officially gave me uh, an offer. Oh, okay. Uh, sent me all the terms and conditions, mm -hmm. and I was happy with it. Yeah. Uh, so today I signed their offer. It's mm -hmm. a very lucrative offer. Yeah. And uh, yes, I've even since resigned from my current uh, role. Oh. Yes. Does that mean we are moving to Madrid? Yes, Spain is our new home. Oh my God! I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm equally excited. And I can't wait to raise our kids in Europe. Rob. Of course, yes. Now that that is the next home for us, guys. Okay. Benson for making time for this meeting. I just needed to let you know that we have some delays with the immigration uh, on your relocation for your family and for yourself. But in the meantime, we will set you up to work remotely. But for today, I want to introduce you to Mr. Martin, our Chief Growth Officer. Hi Benson, it is a pleasure to meet you. I am happy to have you as part of our team. You have joined us at a very critical time. We have just completed onboarding a key customer who we anticipate will set us up for our next growth phase. You will be most suited to handle this client as he marks our entry into the francophone market. You being in Senegal for the next few days gives us the advantage of local and regional knowledge. Once again, welcome to the team and I hope you settle in quickly. Well, yeah, thank you so much for the support um, you have given me so far. I feel credible uh, and I have what it takes uh, to take um, on this client. I look forward to working with you, Martin. We will be receiving updates uh, from the respective teams. Uh, Mercedes, please kick us off. Um, thank you, Martin, and good morning, all. I'm happy to report that we met and developed a roadmap with the customer and I expect that the project will be complete a month ahead of time. Thank you. Oh, that's impressive. Good work. Thank you so much, Mercedes. Thank you, sir. Uh, Benson will be joining us online. Benson, it's now your turn. Yes, uh, thank you. Um, so, good morning, all. Um, so, we need to make any significant milestones on the project because I'm still working on the project plan. Uh, we have planned to have a project initiation meeting in a week's time uh, with the clients to clearly understand the roles and responsibilities um, and align further on the product line. So we are yet to begin? Yes, we have made some progress, but we are yet to begin. Have you prepared a project plan? Um, so uh, uh, allow me to get back to you on that after this meeting. No, 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 Benson. No, Benson. This is not what I was expecting from you. I'm so proud of you for all the achievements that you've done. You've always been so hardworking. The kids and I are so excited to be moving to Madrid and I just wanted us to celebrate this nice moment. Thank you so much, appreciate it. I would like to take this moment to celebrate with you this wonderful moment. Okay, thank you. Wow, this is a good surprise. Thank you. It's all for you. You deserve it. All of us. To your success. success. Yes. Have a good life. To a good life. And my dreams. <laughs> Hi Robert. Hi Martin. How are you? Uh, good, good. How is the going? So far so good. Uh, but to be honest, I have a challenge. Oh, what's the problem? Benson. Benson again? What has he done this time now? From his experience and CV, 
This is not what I was expecting. I'm receiving so much pressure from the customer. The project has not started. I think we might lose this customer. Oh! Why? What's the, what's the, what's the challenge? You know, this is a top customer. I don't think we can afford to lose this customer. No, we cannot. Have you discussed it with Anna? No, I haven't. No, Martin, this one we have to find ways of pulling it off because we can't afford to lose this customer. We need to do all that we can so that we ensure that this project is started. Just give me a minute. Hi, Anna. I'm good, Mr. Rupert. Only please come to my office right away. Hi, Anna. How are you? Hi, I'm good. good. How is it going? You good. Just setting Benson. Oh, how is he going? He is okay, but he's on a way on leave now. Okay, uh, there's a big problem here. I'm seeing a complaint from uh, Martin that Benson is not able to execute the project. As we speak right now, there is nothing has been done so far. And as we all know, this is one of our top customers, and I don't think we can afford to let anything go wrong with this project. Mr. Roberts. Benson came very highly recommended from the hand hunter, and especially with his past experiences with the companies he has worked for, uh, he has overachieved. And I, I would ask Martin, what is the challenge, Mr. Martin? To be honest, I don't know. I don't know where we picked this guy from. Whatever I read on his CV does not match anything that I have seen. He is too slow, we are behind with the customer, and I'm afraid we might lose this client. It looks like we made a wrong choice. I think it's high time to admit because if as we speak right now, this thing is not yet off, I think we have to make a decision. And uh, for me, can we call uh, Benson? Because if you look at uh, the cost involved in relocating him to, my, to Spain, and even the cost that we are paying him, and he cannot believe I even kickstart such a project, I think call him and tell him you're not willing to relocate him to, my, uh, to Spain. Maybe are we going to confirm him to his probation? But Mr. Roberts, we have HR policies and we also have to weigh in on the legal implications. Mr. Martin, have you considered any other alternative? You could give Mercedes this project to kickstart, or you could hire a technical assistant to help Martin settle. Or alternatively, you could also guide him, hold his hand, help him kickstart the project. Mercedes' hands are full right now. I would have held his hand, but he is not here. How soon do you think we can get him here? Now, with the immigration issues, I don't think it is going to be soon. I think it is clear that Benson will not deliver this. So, as I've said, currently I can't uh, think over this again because it is clear he will not be able to deliver this project. And because he can't, we cannot trust or wait that he will deliver in the future. So as I've said, can we call him? This deal is off the table. I'm not willing to spend money to relocate him to Spain. Uh, Martin, can we reorganize your resources and plan effectively? Let's see how we can kick start this project as soon as possible. Hello, Benson. Hello, how are you? Um, I've just come from a meeting from the chief growth and innovation manager and the CEO. There are complaints about your work, the quality of your work, and the performance since you onboarded you. And a decision has been made that you will not be relocated to Madrid and TMX. And a TMX will not be confirming you at the end of your probation period. Wait, 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 what? Are you, are you serious? Uh, but how did this happen? To be honest, I, I, I feel like I have had enough support in this, in, in this role. Uh, the handover was never smooth. I was given a project which is uh, honestly a big project. So, and I've not been given enough time to adjust to the role. Uh, what's really happening? What? But, but I already told all our friends and family. I've moved the kids from school. What am I supposed to do? I know, it's, I'm, I'm sorry, but... Is that my no, 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 no. This is really, really, really bad. 